Hello mga motorista and welcome to another episode of Motorista Adventures For this video, finally, andito na sa Pilipinas ang ating 2024 Toyota Hilux GRS And this is the best looking Hilux to date mga motorista in my opinion Napakaganda talaga niyang tignan especially dito sa harap Now for the GRS for 2024, again Toyota have ditched the previous GRS design uh, more lifestyle and gone with this big masculine look Today, let's talk about all the specs and features that you need to know about this rugged 2024 Toyota Hilux GRS. Now let's talk about the pricing sa ating GRS. It is priced at 2.166 million mga motorista or 2,166,000. And again, yung price na yan is lahat ng Toyota branches. One pricing lang sila which is really good. So 2.166 for this color variant. And kung gusto mo yung emotional red, I think you have to add on around 20,000 for that. No? Everything is basically the same sa kanyang mga sa hood, dito sa side natin, yung panas natin because it's still a Hilux mga motorista. So, Toyota did modify no this one. So, itong ano na to, um, fender extension is napakalaki niya no. And uh, very well integrated naman siya to the bumper. So, meron tayong mga holes dito sa ating bumper, mamaya papakita ko sa inyo. Um, but again, it is well integrated into the bumper and then meron tayong aerodynamic na mga airflow vents dito. And then Again, new for this GRS is the bumper, the lower bumper. Napaka ano, swooping niya, napaka intricate yung design. We also have this parang covering dito sa ating um, LED fog lights which looks quite nice also. And uh, here you can see you have a front sensor as well. And uh, you, you can definitely feel na this is a special one because of the grill. This is a new grill for the GRS and I think the best looking grill in my opinion from Toyota's lineup of course. This is the top spec model. So, meron tayong naka-lettering Toyota. I think it's a lot bigger than before um, with the in comparison to the previous GRS. And you can see your front cameras here. You have your radar sensors dito, Mama Trista. And you also get, of course, your GR badge. Now, let's take a look at the lower part. No? So, this has been redesigned yung grill. So, meron siyang para swooping up na mga lines no, sa kanyang uh, outline. And uh, different din yung lines dito sa ating lower part ng grill. Um, and uh, dito naman din yung front bumper natin is protruding no, palabas siya. And then meron pa din tayong skid plate underneath. And then meron tayong mga recovery hooks no, so dito sa harapan. It's not, uh, you cannot see it mga motorista. So yung GRS na to is a lot taller than the previous GRS. And I, I think it gained a couple of uh, millimeters mga motorista. Yeah, by beam LED. LED um, DRLs, LED turn signal lights, no? So, that's the headlight. So let's take a closer look dito sa side ng ating Toyota Hilux GRS. And definitely, it's quite macho, especially on the front end. But also on the side, no? You can definitely see na they put a lot of effort uh, for this model year's GRS. Ayan, meron tayong mud guards here, Mama Teresa, for the front. It's much wider than before. Ayan, so kita nyo, mas wider na yan. And then also yung ating tires and rims. Now it is a 17-inch rim. Instead of the previous 18s, it's still blacked out and more off-road biased siya na design. Yung rims and also yung tires natin is a new Yokohama Geolander all-terrain. It, it is not uh, G015, now it's G94. I think this is the latest model na all-terrain ni Yokohama. Yung tread pattern natin is still like 50-50 highway and uh, off-road. And you can see your stabilizer bar there. And then also you can see Mama Trista, they've actually changed the suspension. So ayan, kita nyo yung ating springs. So double wishbone suspension pa rin dito sa harap. You have your GR calipers. No? Nakahidon yung mga disc brake natin because of the design sa ating uh, no, rims. Ayan, so GR calipers natin, disc brake sa harap. You have mud guards here. Step board stays the same. Hilux is blacked out. Nakalagay. Side mirrors the same as the previous model. 
and you have your camera here you have your ano, um, lighting dito sa ilalim or yung ating puddle lamps now on the side you have the, uh, blacked out na mga door handles smart entry and engine push to start button as well pinakalikod ng ating GRS you can see na a lot has changed no, sa rear part na to so I'm not sure about some of the details pero definitely yung ating frame here is kind of different no? it's, I think it's reinforced Correct me if I'm wrong, Motorista, but um, yan no, meron tayong bar dyan, which the, ano, dyan nakalagay din yung ating spare tire. And that spare tire also, Motorista, it is the same tire and wheel as what's on the vehicle. So, full size siya and then parehas pa din yung rim natin. That's quite nice. And then, here you have your shock absorber. It's outward na. You can see the welding marks, Motorista, no, they welded it on the frame, of course, and then... Again, they weld it on the outside. So again, they really tested it out, tested this out, no, for more um, stability on road and also better articulation off road. Then, a lip spring pa din tayo, no. So nothing has changed there. So you can carry still heavy cargo with this one uh, because again, you have that uh, lip spring type na suspension as well. For this new GRS is the addition of a uh, disc brake. So so this is the only Hilux in the range na meron siyang disc brake. That's quite nice. And then, you can also see the GR calipers, no? So, hindi mo siya kitang-kita talaga because, again, of the designs ating grips. So, kung medyo low profile ng onti yung ating rims, it, you can definitely see the ventilated disc dyan. You still have this really big over fenders also, mga motorista, no, dito sa likuran. And another thing for the GRS is meron siyang sports bar dito. Um, I think this for more of a st aesthetic look. Wala siyang cargo lighting. Meron tayong fin type antenna. It's black as well. Um, kasama na yung ating bed liner if you purchase the GRS. Parehas lang talaga siya sa previous model na Hilux. No? Nothing change uh, when it comes to the rear part. No? So, very familiar here. So, you have your Hilux name. GR Sport Badge. You have blacked out na Toyota name there. And then, you have your reverse camera here. And high mount stoplight is on the tailgate. Naka tailgate assist pa din siya and clearly also see na meron siyang lip dito no. So this is for the blind spot monitoring sensors. So kaya bawal siyang apakan no. So ingat kayo mga motorista if you're gonna purchase this uh, Hilux na merong blind spot monitor kasi andito siya nakalagay. So apat na sensors sa ating bumper. That you should know is that meron tayong ready na siya no for a yan tow bar mga motorista no meron na siyang um, lalagyan dito. So, sa Australia, meron silang mga recovery points here, but dito sa atin, it's just a bar. But you can definitely add on accessory tow bars dito. It is made for that, and it is uh, nicely bolted on to the frame. Okay, so okay. let's talk about the engines ating uh, Toyota Hilux GRS. It is the same 1G DFTB 2.8 liter double overhead cam variable nozzle turbo direct injected diesel engine. Of course, four cylinder. So nothing changed definitely here. It's basically the same engine. So I think the tuning is a little bit different. Medyo mas aggressive siguro. This engine now makes 224 PS of maximum power and 550 Newton meters of torque which is paired to a 6-speed automatic transmission. So the same lang din yung ating transmission than before. Let's talk about the interior sa ating Hilux GRS and uh, before we open up everything, let's talk about the key. Let's see if it's the same. I think it's the same. So you have this parang uh, uh, large key, magaan lang siya. So meron tayong lock, unlock, and the horn button here. So you have a GR no, nakalagay. No? So that's something para special for the GR models or GR Sport models from Toyota. Of course, the doors are basically the same. Nothing major change here. Automatic up, up and down sa lahat ng mga windows natin. And then, leather pa din yung ating armrest. I think this is quite different na design. So, again, but still, definitely similar lang siya sa ating previous GRS. You have 6-way adjustable driver seat. Yan, so slide, recline, 
and then you have your airbag dito so 7 airbags si Hilux GRS different na din yung design dito sa top no so meron siyang parang I'm not sure but kind of looking printed I'm not, definitely not a fan of the design but anyways you can see here na meron tayong blind spot monitoring na button here you can turn it off or turn it on you have your 360 degree view camera so if you want to change the view you press this one and then you have your parking sensors on and off you have latches for your hood and your fuel tank and then you have sport pedals for the GRS no pasensya na kung medyo madumi kakarating lang talaga nito from shipping no so again lilinisan naman nila to pag uh, ipapurchase mo na so pasok tayo sa loob let's take a look at what's uh, changes can we see here so definitely not a lot of changes Mama Teresa, when it comes to the interior design uh, but of course you have that specialty GRS Mama Teresa, no? ayan kita mo you have red strip here meron dotted no, na parts sa ating steering wheel and then also you have this GRS na naming here meron siyang automatic on off headlights ayan meron din siyang paddle shifters for the GRS you have your ano, uh, airbag also you have cruise control and it is also adaptive you can adjust your uh, adaptive cruise mga motorista here you have your volume control knobs you have your navigation buttons dun sa ating 4.2 inch display so meron siyang 4x4 na mga system so it has limited slip differential rear locking differential meron ka ding um, hill descent or downhill assist control design wise nothing to get excited about parehas lang to again we have this parang new design dito sa ating dash now not a fan of it no? it kinda looks printed uh, but anyway, the new thing that I really like right now is yung ating display dito sa harap. Finally, an upgrade sa infotainment system ni Toyota Hilux. So this is what I'm waiting for. Look at that. It's HD quality na mga motorista yung ating Hilux. Now, definitely looks aftermarket yung kanyang uh, design. You even have this parang sasakyan dito. Uh, you can definitely change it to a uh, previous generation Hilux. No? 20, that's a 2010 model Hilux. Uh, but uh, you can change it no, to whatever you like alright so ayan so back so uh, more like a android head unit na siya apple carplay android auto everything is wireless mga motorista so that's a really nice add-on as well uh, so ayan nagbiblink blink pa yung sasakyan dyan mga motorista no? so you have bluetooth connectivity not the nicest thing in the world is meron kang usb port here so you have to wire down no kung may i-coconnect ka na device na no, if you want to charge it on the head unit itself but again, thankfully, this has wireless CarPlay and Android Auto. So, napaka-ano niya, napaka-responsive, no? Yung ating 9-inch display. Well naman siya, Mama Teresa, dito sa ating dash. It is more of that gloss black finish. Reverse camera. So, once we put the Hilux GRS on reverse, you can clearly see na uh, it's kind of reflective yung ating, ano no, yung ating head unit. But again, I really like the, the bigger display. So, Hindi pa din siya ganun ka-clear yung ating cameras, no? But again, you have 360-degree view camera and you have a uh, trajectory. Yan. Pati sa harap, meron siyang trajectory and you can change the view. Alright, so again, not uh, again trailing behind si Hilux, mga motorista, in my opinion, when it comes to uh, quality sa kanilang mga cameras. But anyway, you still have it. It's, it's still nice to have. There's also a new thing. So, meron na tayong wireless charger. So you can actually fit your phone here, your iPhone, and no pa, you can turn it on or turn it off. And then you have your yan, mga ano, battle holders. Econ, power mode, 6-speed automatic transmission, gated type. So meron kang my, uh, no, manual mode, plus and minus, but you can use the paddle shifter instead. Okay, so you have traditional handbrake as well. So now it, ano, it uses the disc brake sa likuran for the parking brake. And then, yan, this is the same. Same lang din. Dito, definitely same. Air conditioning, eh, air condition siya. And then, here, damp, and meron siyang lock. Still the same seats as the previous GRS. So, yan, it is embossed yung ating GR na, na logo here. You have, um, I think this is suede material and meron siyang hose. So it's not that hot. No, lalo na uh, mainit, no? Dito sa atin. Uh, but still, uh, the same with the previous GRS and really like this belts no very very nice looking belts red color seen also na tilt and telescopic yung ating steering wheel um, one thing though is I think that steering is kind of heavy in my opinion mga motorista 
maybe because of the the tires um it is a wider tire it is a thicker tire and all terrain din siya so that adds a little bit of weight no wala tayong vanity mirror dito sa passenger meron uh, auto dimming rear view mirror here mga motorista okay so andito tayo sa likod ng ating Hilux GRS for 2024 and uh, definitely it's still really nice although it doesn't feel as spacious as the competition yung likuran nito meron tayong hawakan dito mga motorista so, bottle holder speaker auto up and down windows blacked out yung ating headliner and definitely another big change for the GRS like the previous GRS is you have rear air vents which is very nice to have especially in our weather and definitely I'm a lot more comfortable dito than a Hilux Conquest mga motorista because of this rear air vent no? so you don't need to ano talagang lakasan yung air conditioning dun sa harap kasi uncomfortable din pag malakas yung aircon eh just so your rear passengers can um, get cooler diba so ayan this is a really good addition unfortunately though wala tayong mga ports dito sa likuran pero tayong 4 kg hooks you have your ayan meron tayong pockets dito pockets dito again 4 kg dito na hook and then quite spacious yung ating tunnel hindi siya ganun kataas so it's not as uncomfortable as the Ford Rangers ayan so easy lang natin i-cross yung paan natin and um still kind of suede seats here the seats dito sa likod is mostly upright siya yeah you have your bottle holders dito sa likuran and of course we cannot forget our seat belts na red color motorista yung ating Toyota Hilux for 2024 na GRS and definitely the one to get if you're looking for a ready off-road na machine no, from this brand. If you're planning to buy one, please do visit Toyota Cagayan de Oro and uh, special shout out to them because once it got here, I already made a video for it and uh, that's why na-upload ko na tong video na to immediately para sa inyo mga motorista. So, maraming salamat sa kanila and please do visit their showroom if you're from Mindanao, Northern Mindanao. Don't forget to hit thumbs up, subscribe, click that notification bell for more videos in this channel and do always follow my Facebook page. I also upload our videos with this GRS dun sa ating Facebook page, Motorista Adventures. Maraming salamat and I'll see you on the next episode.